and welcome to one of my videos where I am actually a person uh, rather than a VR person, a virtual person. Uh, but yeah, so I am here to kind of talk about what I'm about to do with my name change. Um, I am doubting that people will really care too much about this name change. It's not like I have a huge audience or anything. But it just, it feels like a big change to me, and so I kind of wanted to talk about it here a little bit, um, and kind of just explain what's happening, why I'm, I'm changing the name, and it's, it's almost like I'm growing out of my childhood right now, in a sense. Um, I'll give a little bit of background on Burnt Pan, I don't know if I really have in the past in any of my videos, um, but... Yeah, I mean, I started with Burnt Pan as a name in, uh, gosh, I don't even know how long ago, probably more than 10 years ago, when I was playing this game called Team Fortress 2, TF2, um, and uh, yeah, I guess I've, I've gone over that a little bit in one of my videos, I think, and, uh, but I guess kind of to reiterate, um, I really love that game. I put like more than 2,500 hours into that game. Uh, and it was a PC game, and uh, yeah, I was a PC gamer, and basically there was a, a pan in that game, which was a weapon, and there was like a special type of that pan called the strange pan that would count your kills, and that pan just tended to be overpowered. Um, I don't think it was actually overpowered, it was more just like a meme weapon, and sometimes it hit really critical shots and it was just like it was great and it was really fun and as more of a kid at that time I just like got a blast out of or had a blast while hitting people with pans uh, in Team Fortress 2 so that was kind of the the moment that I decided hey I want to I want to change my name from at the time uh, some like username that I used to have in a school um, and that was kind of silly to have as a gamer tag. So I changed from that to Burnt Pan, and I kind of just figured, oh, let's put a word in front of Pan. It doesn't have to be Strange Pan. It doesn't have to be, like, TF2 Pan or whatever. Just put a random word, uh, adjective. I think that's, that's the type of word. I'm not an English, uh, major or anything special, but I think it's an adjective. So yeah, Burnt Pan came to be, and uh, I kind of just stuck with it. I liked it, and... My friends just had kind of had a blast calling me Burn Pan because it was just so stupid, and we would all always laugh about it because it's it's a pretty dumb name. Just calling a person by an inanimate object a burnt pan is just so weird, especially if you don't know the background behind it. It's even weirder, and in fact, that's kind of the reason I wanted to change it because it does feel so weird for people to call me Burnt Pan, especially when in VR you have that sense of presence and like it feels a lot more personal in VR than it does when you're playing a flat screen game and you're just talking into each other's ears. You're actually talking to the person in VR, to the person standing in front of you even if it's more of an animated person and doesn't look super realistic, it's still a person. Um, and I know it's still a person in flat screen too, but I don't know. It just felt like the time I don't need to be called Burnt Pan anymore. Um, I don't need to keep like any sort of anonymity online. Um, and I mean, it's, it's still nice to be, I guess, kind of private with my life, but um, I, I don't need to. Being Burnt Pan or being JJ isn't going to change anything, uh, at least as far as I can really tell. Um, so. Yeah, and that, that was kind of the, the Burnt Pan origin and, and why I think that I am ready to change my name uh, and go into the JJ Bonta phase on YouTube. And it was definitely fun while it lasted being called Burnt Pan and having to explain Burnt Pan to everybody and uh, just having fun conversations and hearing people call me an inanimate object is, is just... It was a good time. It was a good time. And and I liked my profile picture. It's pretty cool. Like, a little burnt pan animation, or yeah, I guess it's an animation. Art. A little art with a pan, and like burning pan, and it's got my name in it. But, yeah. It is time.
time for me to move on and become J.J. Vonta, evolve into J.J. Vonta, the person I was always meant to be, or the person I already am. It's it's really weird, but yeah, I think that kind of kind of sums it up. I don't know if I'm gonna like cut out or edit anything in this video. I, I think that it's one of those like vlog type videos. No matter how cheesy that that is for a lot of people, I feel like it's this is one of those videos I I wanted to do that for. I, I felt the need that like. Hey, I probably just should. Why not? My face is already out there. My name's already out there. Might as well just change my name and make a video about it. And, uh, yeah. I hope you enjoy something from it if you last until now. Uh, and for whoever did, let me know in the comments if there's anything I might have le left out. Uh, I know that some friends will probably watch this and make fun of it. Or, I don't know, maybe... Maybe I did leave something big out that I forgot to explain, but uh, yeah, that was, that was essentially it. And I, I think I'm gonna, oh, at the very end, maybe I'll do like a little edit for this, but I got my, got my burnt pan right here. Uh, sorry, not my burnt pan, my Brawlhalla. This is the game that I, I guess, identified with burnt pan the most, um, even though TF2 is where I got the name, Brawlhalla is the like a just a competitive game that I was really in it. I put more hours, I more than twenty five hundred, which was around the same amount of hours as TF two. But I I put more like dedication and hours into Brawlhalla and made some money doing tournaments and like that was that was my biggest game until now Dungeons of Eternity. But yeah, changing to Burnt Pan. Sorry, from Burnt Pan to. JJ Bonta, no longer burn pan. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video and peace out.